Amy, thank you. Well, the man who says that he was slapped by Miami Dolphins wide receiver Tyreek Hill has hired an attorney. And the surveillance video of the incident could soon be made public. NBC 6's Heather Walker is live from Northeast Miami. Dave, with the latest on the case. Heather. Juwan, sources telling me that right between these two boats, that's where the Miami football star allegedly slapped the employee of the fishing fleet. Who's winning? This is Tyreek Hill, the Miami Dolphins wide receiver known as the Cheetah, hours after the alleged slap. Don't grab him, Drew. Don't grab him, Drew. Holy my God. He's so, he's so... This video causing controversy, but the potential charges stem from what happened on land this past Father's Day. The alleged victim in that case works here at Kelly Fishing Fleet. He's hired an attorney and is not talking. But sources tell us Hill was here with friends illegally fishing when the employee says he saw two women from the group on one of the fishing boats without permission. When the employee told them to get off, that's when Hill allegedly slapped him on the back of his neck. We're told Hill had to be pushed away by his friends. The report also says when police were called the next day, the victim had no visible injuries. And that is the latest from police. Now, we did reach out to Hill for a comment. He did not get back to us. So for now, we're going to have to wait and see if any charges are pressed and if that video is released. Reporting live in Miami-Dade, Heather Walker, NBC6 News.